Kate Middleton feared for her daughter, Princess Charlotte, the day she was born, while the two posed for photographs on the steps at the Lindo wing of St. Mary's Hospital alongside Prince William, newly resurfaced footage reveals. Last week, Princess Charlotte and her brother Prince George made a surprise appearance at the King's Cup Royal Sailing Regatta with their parents and grandparents. In an adorable video, Kate is seen encouraging her four-year-old daughter to wave at onlookers in Cow's, Isle of Wight, but the playful Charlotte had other ideas and stuck her tongue out instead, pulling a funny face. The footage, which was uploaded to Instagram by InStyle magazine, was praised by Royals fans, with parents especially relating to Kate's fantastic response. The Duchess was seen thoroughly enjoying her daughter's antics and laughing afterwards. The future queen appears much more at ease with her children and not overly anxious, as opposed to four years ago, when Charlotte first came into the world. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge stepped out on the steps at the Lindo Wingo of St. Mary's Hospital with their newborn daughter only a few hours after her birth, much to the public's delight, who had been waiting for days to see a glimpse of the couple and their newborn. During Charlotte's big reveal though, Kate reportedly kept worrying about her baby. According to a 2015 Daily Telegraph report, as millions saw the new princess for the first time, the Duchess of Cambridge expressed fears Charlotte might be cold. Despite Prince William reassuringly saying to her no, she's fine, she's good, the doting mother said, let's take her inside. Charlotte was not the only royal child well-wishers saw that day, as Prince William had earlier taken George to the hospital to meet his little sister for the first time. The couple did not do any interviews following the birth of the little princess but in 2013 the Duke of Cambridge described how he felt during his first appearance on the steps at the Lindo Wing for the birth of Prince George. He told CNN, I think more shock was the feeling I felt, but I was on such a high anyway, and so was Catherine, about George that really we were happy to show him off to whoever wanted to see him. As any new parent knows, you're only too happy to show off your new child and, you know, proclaim that he is the best looking or the best everything. It's nice that people want to see George. I'm just glad he wasn't screaming his head off the whole way through. The second in line to the throne also admitted that when he deftly secured his son's car seat in the back of his vehicle on the first try, there was more than luck involved in the perfectly executed manoeuvre. He said, believe, me it wasn't my first time. I know there's been some speculation about that. I had to practice, I really did. I was terrified it was going to fall off or the door wasn't going to close properly. When asked if the decision of driving his young family home was to reinforce perceptions that he will bring a more modern apro. Charlotte seemingly enjoys the attention of the cameras as she is often seen waving to members of the public. The young royals were treated to an action-packed day as both their parents competed in the regatta. Prince William finished ahead of his wife in the race which was eventually won by TV adventurer Bear Grylls. Kate was presented with a giant wooden spoon after she was disqualified from the race. Kensington Palace later shared a picture of her with her head in her hands alongside the caption, it's the taking part that counts. The event raised £1 million for the Cambridge's favourite charities. The children were later spotted on a boat with grandfather Michael, before entertaining Kate's mother Carol as both continued to pull silly faces for the photographers. Prince George was pictured in a captain's hat as Princess Charlotte relaxed and enjoyed the picturesque surroundings. The children joined in the festivities at a local fair, with the royals enjoying a fierce tug-of-war competition and learning how to become a pirate. Youngest sibling Prince Louis was not in attendance at the charity sailing event but did join the rest of his family on the Isle of Wight. The Cambridge children have enjoyed a quiet upbringing in the seclusion of their Kensington Palace and Anmer Hall homes. They have been spotted spending family time together, with all five members of the family enjoying the Duchess of Cambridge's garden at the Chelsea Flower Show. Prince Louis was seen on a homemade garden swing, with Prince George jumping between rocks with his sister.